This video will describe the safety features of the Orja refueling rig when used with the Orja Pack methanol onboard charging system. Fueling the rig is as simple as connecting the Parker Dry Connect to the Orja Pack system with a simple pressurized action and connecting the data cable to the unit. The Orja Pack has over 70 sensors that feed information about its performance to the rig. To start the refueling process, you move over to the control panel, push the start button, and starting is in process. Should there be any problem, you can immediately stop the refueling process via the emergency stop button. The control panel also displays a number of different states. If there's a spill within the refueling rig, uh, when the water needs to be emptied, when fuel needs to be replaced, and a number of other parameters. When you're done refueling the rig, the origin pack, you just place the hose back on the rig. Another safety feature of the origin pack refueling rig is the dry disconnect. Should someone drive away from the refueling rig without detaching from the origin pack on their pallet jack or vehicle, the dry disconnect will safely disconnect from the refueling rig with no spill at either end where the Parker disconnect, dry disconnects are used. Adding fuel to the rig is a very simple process as well. You merely place the 55 gallon drum onto the roller base bottom and push it onto the rig. It's a simple one person process. Your methanol drum will ship with this simple to use fill container dry connect. Just push it in. No fumes or methanol is exposed to the operator because of this simple quick connect and disconnect system. A few quick turns and you're ready to go. Grounding wire is provided to connect to the metal drum. Grounding points on the refueling rig are numerous. Notice there's a water spill sensor not connected. It's a sonic sensor, so there are no uh, penetrations into the water drum. When you're ready to remove the full water drum from the refueling rig, again, the same connector, a few quick turns. You remove the connector component, and it's a dry, dripless connector. Sensors within the refueling rig are Nemore sensors, non-incentive, class one, division two, rated for this environment. Explosion proof motors, sensors, solenoids, feeds through, UL rated pump, and cables. Sensor for hazards, the water, See here the yellow sensor also for the a water level. The rig is enclosed in a secure all cabinet, FM rated. All penetrations are made at the f and sealed at the factory. Bolt-ons are done. Penetrations through at the factory. We only bolt on some uh, equipment for the outside, for the handle. FPA code 30 supports all OSHA regulations. And note behind the cabinet, it's clean, compact, no penetrations.